that we are just one part of the nature. So the gardening is just, uh, um, I think, opportunity to realize that for everyone, I think. Yeah. It's fun being here when it's cold. Yeah. <laughs> and also we're alone, you know, there's yeah. usually so many yeah. people around. Yes, yeah. I'm wondering at this point, what are you, what are you focusing on? What's on your to-do list? <laughs> uh, this year we are really, really lucky because the snow the melts is quite early time. So it's a really delightful moment at this stage because we survived the long, harsh winter. Uh, yeah, we survived the mountain blizzard. <laughs> so um, we just want to respect you know that new season I mean they're coming to the forest so we clean up all around even the forest we have a lot of different stages the forest looks very wild but we actually we put our hands in it and then we support that you know that all the plants you know could start the growing in the healthiest condition you have a certain amount of um native species to mm -hmm. the area yeah and then there's also you know deliberate plantings mm -hmm. i'm wondering um kind of which parts of this garden are natural mm -hmm. and which ones are heavily curated right i can't say that a natural stage is that that's what we have actually in japanese shizendo the shizem is natural nature do means level we uh, try to understand what kind of environment the, the garden is actually and I, here at the Millennium Forest I think the forest garden is quite high because there are so many things we just uh, trust the native species as it is as they are so but like perennial garden designed by garden designer and that uh, like there is a vision by the, you know the people and human beings that means that the landscape should be the, you know the supported or uh, cultivated to follow the vision so i think that's a difference of a natural you know the closer to wild nature or closer to the place or for the people you know yeah i love that that it's, <laughs> that it's kind of like it's all natural. Mm. Let's yes, just, it's all natural. Yes, true. That's it's all true. natural. Yes. <laughs> now yes. let's just figure out the level at mm. which yeah. it yeah. is, yeah. right? Yeah. And and on one end mm. of the spectrum we have mm. super wild, mm. and then on the other one it's very you know mm -hmm. kind of cultivated yeah. and cared yes. for and yes. influenced. Yes. Huh. Yeah. I love that way of thinking mm. about it. I think it's important to, to analyze the, that area's purpose or like vision. I said, you know what kind of uh, story in you know, the background of that place that's a, a whole point i think to you know decide the method or policy of a maintaining or gardening you know nature works on such a different time frame mm -hmm. than we do mm -hmm. do you find that the garden has made you more patient mm, exactly and i think that's a you know the very good for the gardeners because the patience is very important as a gardener. So, yeah, I think we have a good training by nature, I can say. <laughs> like, just wait for it, wait for yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. And it don't, you know, don't miss the moment and timing. Takashi Millennium Forest and Midori and Shintaro are, to me, shining examples of what it looks like when humans can have a beneficial impact on nature we can actually do good. It's time that we all get outside more and explore how. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you liked it, hit subscribe, share it with friends, and feel free to leave a note in the comments. I will write back. One more thing. Before we go, I received a lot of questions from my gardening friends about which tools Midori and Shintaro use at the garden. I've included a little video clip that shows those off and also links to similar tools in the description of this video. Check them out. This is a scissors tree. Yeah. Okay. We used uh, mainly, you know, the uh, prune trees and the perennials, also the nursery work to divide the plants as well. <laughs> this one, yeah. Mm. It's the 
picker trees, you know, pruning and picker trees, you know. Actually, the, we can cut to the wire as well. It's not, yeah, the here. The it has a color. nice, like, bounce mm, to it. Yeah, Chintaro's one is a Japanese one. So it's different style. Ooh. Mm, the beautiful one. Yeah. What, what company is this? That looks beautiful. Kisaku. <laughs> mm, yeah, Kisaku. Okay, so same thing. Again, yeah, same thing. Ooh. Yeah. It's Whoa. a big one. Yeah. <laughs> it's like an alligator. And this one this is a one saw. Yes, yeah, so. Look at the branches and the trees. Yeah. Thanks for watching Down to Earth, and I'll see you next week. Takachi Millennium Forest is a 1,000 acre environmental conservation project. It includes a. There's a mosquito. Move out of the way, please. <laughs>